Coming up next week in Brussels, a mini plenary, defence, economic governance and money, money, money. Welcome to the agenda. Kicking things off, a bit of joy for some 500 Finnish workers. The EU Globalisation Adjustment Fund has a piggy bank of some 500 million euros it can give to member states. On Tuesday, the Budget Committee will vote in Finland's application to receive 1.365 million euros for the 568 workers made redundant by the electronic firm Broadcom. 2015 was declared the year of development, but what's the plan for the years ahead? A hearing is set to take place at the Parliament to discuss that very thing. The EU channels a lot of money into development, with projects to help communities all over the world get out of poverty. But with the effects of climate change taking root, what more can be done? Find out on Monday. As the mini plenary returns to Brussels, the big discussion, the upcoming EU Council on Defence. The big question, does there need to be a rethink on the EU security and defence policy? In recent years, member states have tightened their national defence budgets. Has that had an effect on the EU's collective ability? MEPs will debate on Wednesday. How to solve Europe's economic problems while it's an issue that continues to divide opinion. The Economic and Monetary Affairs Committee voted in favour of a resolution to tweak the rules on economic governance last Tuesday. The author of the report has said that the fact that the Commission President Jean-Claude Juncker rolled out an investment plan, it shows that the current system isn't working. The resolution will go to a vote at the plenary on Wednesday. Well, one way to get the economy back on track is by creating a better environment for businesses. And that's what's on the way as a fairer tax system for corporations is on the cards. Representatives of the Commission will wrap up the plenary session with a word on the action plan. And that's all we have for this agenda. Take care and enjoy the week.